Most people surround themselves with some kind of family during the holiday season. If you're among the lucky ones, now is the perfect time to talk to them about your success plans for next year. Rule one, you can talk about what happened last year, but only if you also include the lessons that you've learned and the successes that you've experienced. Keep it positive. Positive talk and lessons learned induce others to talk about their positive events and their lessons learned. Many people struggled last year. You may be among them, or your relatives may be among them. And as your conversation or storytelling evolves, you have choices. I recommend that you choose not to lament what didn't happen and focus on what did happen. Once you get into the groove of talking out last year and somehow recalling the good, finding the pony inside the barn of horse manure, it will give you an opportunity to begin to talk about and clarify what you intend to do next year. Not just your goals, rather your intentions. When you talk about what you intend to do next year, it will begin to clarify it in your own mind. Hearing yourself say the things that you've been thinking about will affirm and strengthen your belief, the validity of your goals and your ideas, and increase your own determination to achieve, all from saying aloud that which you've been thinking. But there's a bonus. By talking your plans out loud, you're indirectly soliciting two things, positive feedback and the support of others. Your family's who you love. Well, maybe not all of them, but certainly a select few. Those are the ones who can give you the most support and encouragement to help you achieve your next year's goals. As you begin talking, I recommend that you keep a laptop close by or some recording device so that as you clarify your thinking and your ideas and your intentions, you can document them. A simple word file will do. Something that you can expand on as you begin to write all of your ideas down. Here's a personal note. Every time that I've ever talked out or talked out loud, my ideas and my goals, I've always rushed to document them, more often than not achieve them as a result of that action. When you start out on the first of the year to achieve your goals and dreams, you may have every intention of achieving them. Reality dictates that some, or many, won't make it to the finish line. Part of the reason people don't achieve their goals is that they haven't clarified them in their own mind before they begin the achievement process. Stating them aloud is an important part of this clarification process. You're not simply telling others, you're also telling yourself. And as you're speaking, you're also thinking and expanding your own thoughts to where they make sense to everyone, including you. The more you talk about them, the more clear they become, the more actionable they become, and the deeper your belief in them grows. Your family gathering is an important emotional part of your growth. Seek out the people that you respect the most. Talk to them as openly as possible. Brace yourself for their honest feedback and make certain that you keep it positive. Make certain that you keep it truthful and make certain that you keep it engaging. As you're looking for opinions and ideas, also make certain that you enlist their support. Tell them you're counting on them. Tell them how grateful you are for their support and thank them in advance.